welcome back to the Everyday Workbench. It's April, which means Earth Day is coming up. So I'd like to walk you through some products that you can use on your home projects that will make you a better tenant to Mother Earth. So these are all like tenant, like you live here, you can get. But these are all greener products that are gonna save you money and just work more efficiently. And a lot of times they're safer products as well. So it's all great stuff. So the first two have to do with water conservation. And this is a big one here putting a timer on your hose outside anytime you're watering your lawn. You want to be very conservative with your water usage out there. Putting a timer on your outdoor spigot will help you do that. It's easy, it's cost effective, it's great. One of the areas in the home that is a main culprit of over usage of water and water leaks is your toilet, okay? So this flapper here, they wear out from time to time every three to five years, six years, that flapper wears out, causes a little bit of a leak, which means that you're paying too much on your water bill and you're wasting water. It's a $5 item, it's a 10 minute fix. You should be checking on that every once in a while. Uh, as we're still into plumbing, we do have those pesky clogged drains in our bathrooms. And I'd like to invite you, instead of using a toxic drain cleaner, use a product like the Drain Weasel. There's a lot of products out there on the market like this. It's basically a handheld auger, and these work tremendously for a lot of those pesky clogged drains in the bathrooms. So instead of reaching for the toxic chemical, you're not using any chemical. You're using a little hand auger. It's great. Uh, LED light bulbs. Use them. You save 85% of energy usage when you're using them. Keep using them. Replace any bulbs that aren't LED with LEDs right now. That's an easy one. Diatomaceous earth. This is a great pesticide to use it's an alternative to a lot of the poisons that we use, these bug sprays that we buy. Diatomaceous earth, try it out if you haven't. It's a natural bug pesticide. It's a bug killer, it's great. Peppermint oil, natural bug repellent. A lot of recipes online on how to use peppermint oil safely in and outside the house. It's great, it's peppermint oil. And it smells really, mmm, it smells very nice. So, I don't know, I like that. Uh, Castile soap. Okay, another natural product. There's thousands of uses for Castile soap, okay? It's a great cleaner and it's a great bug repellent as well. In fact, it can be used as a pesticide on houseplants. So it's a repellent and a pesticide when it comes to the bugs. A lot of recipes online with that as well. And of course, vinegar, the MVP of natural products, okay? I happen to like its cousin wine a little bit better, but vinegar is very good. Uh, vinegar is great for ants, it's great for weeds, and of course, it's great for cleaning. So that's another thing. It's not only good for the earth, it's saving you money. And if you've seen any of our other videos, you know I don't always have this luscious forest behind me. This is an awesome plant forest. Isn't this great? Plants are great, trees are great. It's one of my favorite Earth Day projects to do. Plant a tree, plant a shrub, get out into the garden, do something good for the environment, and that definitely is planting a tree or a shrub. Um, so bring a house plant in. That's another tip. These are air cleaners. They're great. They look awesome and they just make you feel good. So that is our April walkthrough. That's our celebration for Earth Day. We all want to be better tenants of the earth. We also want to save money around the house. And uh, these products we just walked through will help you do that. Thank you as always for watching. Everyday Workbench, please leave a comment and tell me what you're doing for Earth Day. Thank you.